In today's video, we'll be talking about how to set up a single WhatsApp account on two different devices. Let's jump right in. One of the requirements that you have to take note of is that you need internet access on the two devices to be able to make use of WhatsApp on both of them. Okay, to install one WhatsApp account on two different devices, as you can see, there are two devices in front of us right now. I want to transfer this, the account that is presently on the screen to the phone on the left. So to be able to do that, you open your Chrome on the device on the left, go to web.whatsapp.com. Once the page loads, you tap on the three dots on the top right and then tap on desktop site. Now, once you tap on desktop site, it brings you to the WhatsApp web platform. All right. Now, once the QR code comes up on the device on the right, that is where the WhatsApp account is re originally installed. You tap on the three dots on the top right, tap on WhatsApp web, click on link a device. And of course you need to authorize, you need to authorize, then use the QR code reader, scan the QR code on, on the new device. Once you're able to successfully scan, you see that the conversations on the device on the right will appear on the device on the left. Okay, so let's take a look. This is the conversation on the device on the right. And then if you zoom in on the device on the left, you see that you have the exact same conversation. I had to use a blank WhatsApp account to avoid for security purposes. So basically that is how to connect WhatsApp on one, 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 one WhatsApp account on two different devices. Now, let's also show how to disconnect the WhatsApp account. In case somebody connects to your WhatsApp account without your authorization, you follow the simple, these uh, simple steps. You tap on the top right, the three dots on the top right, tap on WhatsApp web. You see that there is a device connected to your WhatsApp account. Just tap on that connection, tap on logout. It automatically logs the device whoever that was connected to your account it automatically logs the person out so let's assume somebody without your authority accesses your account that is a very simple way of disconnecting them if this video was useful to you please smash the like button and subscribe to the channel and i'll see you in the next video